We choose photographs for Fort Upon Iowa based on their unique lens into the everyday world. We're drawn to photos of place that connect people to a particular location. For example, a school, maybe your downtown area, maybe you have pictures of your workplace, or a particular recreational area, like a park. We love action photos that tell a story, or are funny, have like a tragic element to them, or involve a situation that people might identify with, like a political rally, or some kind of motorbike, or horseback riding. We like to include photos that communicate a particular cultural practice. We're excited to see different cultural practices across multiple Fort Upon archives. It's important to us to include photos of historical significance. We're interested in any recognizable historical moment and are especially curious about images that have been taken from the unique perspective of an amateur photographer. We're always on the lookout for images that captivate us. There's no hard fast rules for this. It's just a catch all category for all those photos that hold magic. Sometimes there's just a personally touching detail in a photograph or some kind of accidental framing that catches your eye. Sometimes just a special balance between dark and light that you weren't expecting or you accidentally catch a particular human expression. Sometimes just two objects in a frame can interact in an interesting way or one object by itself can be extremely compelling and elevate your everyday photograph into a piece of art. Very often these photos are unintentionally magical, but it's those unintentionally magical images in the Fort Upon Iowa project that give us the most pleasure. Most importantly though, they keep the viewing experience surprising and lyrical. Finally, we have a special appreciation for photographs with people in the act of taking photographs. Can't really explain it, but it's one of our favorite things. Okay, so what photos do we not want from you? If you have copies of photographs, so things like newspaper clippings or scanned prints of the original photograph, we're not looking for those. Don't send us photos that are out of focus. Finally, we tend not to like photos that are overly posed, although we're flexible on that one. We feature photographs from every corner of the state, but the archive also contains images beyond Iowa because we're interested in where Iowans travel, whether it's for a vacation, maybe work or service or visiting extended families, we're interested in how Iowans become Iowans and where they go once they leave. Our lives tend to be interconnected networks that span geographical space and time. So capturing how we make community is a part of this project.